G'day everyone, Mitch Kill from Pan Agcon here again, uh, standing in our sorghum variety trial we've sown here at the uh, the Sydney Uni. One of the only uh, sorghum trials around in the district this year with the uh, due to the drought. Um, lucky enough to have Sydney Uni um, donate the land and a bit of water to get this little strip trial get, strip trial going. Um, we can um, we can see we've got a number of varieties here um, across all the seed companies. Uh, we've got uh, Pack Seeds, Pioneer, S and W Seeds, and Heritage with a few lines. So this uh, this crop was sown on the twentieth of December. Um, so in the sort of the summer planting window, and um, we had a couple of waters over the trial, and um, yeah, ran into that rain. So we've sort of finished pretty softly here. So we'll just move along. We'll start with a few um, pack seeds variety. So standing in the, the good old faithful buster. Uh, needs no introduction. It's been around for a very long time, uh, older than me. So we can, um, yeah, we sort of use this as a check in the variety still, but um, with the, the current breeding um, in the recent years, we're sort of surpassing this variety now, which is which is good news. So um, one thing to note across all these varieties, we just, We'll talk a bit about the midge rating. So obviously this is a midge rating of four with the buster. So with this crop, we'll probably expect to see a bit of late midge arrive here. So we'll talk about the midge rating. So we'll uh, move along. We're here in a, another variety by Pack Seeds. I forgot to mention earlier that this site being the only sorghum in the district, we've uh, had a fair few birds uh, uh, come in and give us a bit of a hammering. So yeah, we'll, if you, you can obviously see a bit of bird damage there. So. That's the effect. But moving on, um, this is Halifax, so a new one from from Pack Seeds. So it's a moderate to to slow maturing variety, um, moderate tillera, um, with a midge rating of of six. Um, reliable variety across all yield ranges. Um, one thing to note is if we're in that higher yielding environment, we probably need to up that plant population by about ten percent. Another Pack Seeds variety here. We're standing in Taurus, uh, probably consistently one of our our good performers in the region um, around Balada. Um, we, um, we've had quite good results with this um, out in the paddock commercially. Uh, yeah, good, good, medium to quick variety. We can see here we've got a lot of, a lot of late tillers came sort of probably after that, that good event of rain we had. Uh, good midge rating and yeah, once again, it's just reliable from, from one end of the yield spectrum to the other just for us. Standing in um, another one from Pack Seeds, Resolute. So a new one from them. So it's a, a medium uh, maturity, uh, looking around in that summertime, about uh, 72 days to flowering. Um, med moderate tillera and good across all yield ranges, this variety as well. So it's a good all rounder. But another thing to note, this has got a really good mid rating. So it's eight plus on the, um, on the scale. Uh, next variety from Pioneer Seeds, this one. So this is um, A75, so one of their newer ones. Um, sort of suited to the, probably east of the highway, so in the higher yielding environments. Um, so above that sort of four, four or five tonne plus. Um, quite a hot, it's probably one of their highest tillering varieties they've got. Um, with also a pretty good midge rating of six. Um, so this, this variety was released last year and um, yeah, look forward to seeing it in the, in the future. Another variety here from Pioneer Seeds. Uh, this is a A66. Unfortunately, we've got a little bit extra bird damage in here, so apologies for that one. This is um, this one was um, yeah released the last couple of years in the drought. Um, good variety in the low to moderate yield range environments. Um, yeah, we're pretty excited to to see this one come through in the next um, next few years with the hopefully some softer conditions. Um, we were pretty happy with it side by side. In a couple of paddocks last year, um, it's got a got a good midge rating of six, and yeah, classes are probably a good all rounder. This is another variety from um, S and W Seeds, so this is a uh, yeah new to the to the sorghum sorghum game. So we've got um, two varieties from these guys. So this one's the SG one two four seven two. Um, it's a, a mature quick maturing, so sixty eight days to flower. Um, quite a a moderate tiller, so you can see here we've got some late tillers that are that are shot up through here, um, and a midge rating of five. Uh, a couple of comments from the breeders on this, which they saw in the in the last couple of years in the dry conditions, are 
quite good um, um, head emergence um, in the dry conditions compared to a lot of other varieties. So this will this will be one to watch out for in the coming years. Next variety from S and W Seeds. Uh, this is SG one one six six eight. So this is a medium maturity, uh, seventy days to the to the flowering. Um, same same tillering as the last, sort of a, a moderate tiller, uh, slightly more compact head, um, um, as you can see, and the, the mid rating on this one's still in the in the pro process of um, getting defined, but um, they're thinking sitting around that five, so same as the same as the last variety. Standing in Heritage Seeds variety HGS one one four. Uh, this is our our probably most consistent variety um, in our area. We've replaced it with the with the MR forty three when it was taken off the market. A lot of our that sort of country's been replaced with this variety, and we've been happy with it in the last sort of few years. Really consistent performer across all yield ranges. Um, it's got a um, yeah, like I said before, a medium maturity similar to Buster, moderate tillera, mid rating a six, and yeah, just always up there in the the top percentile of all the trials. So that's it for our, our variety trial here um, at Sydney Uni. I'd like to thank um, all the breeders and the companies for supplying their seeds, so Pacific Seeds, Pioneer, uh, Heritage Seeds and uh, S&W Seeds. Um, yeah, great. And thanks to the Uni again. Great great for them to supply the water to, to get this, this trial up and running. Unfortunately, the birds have uh, really enjoyed it. Um, but yeah, that's that's out of our control, unfortunately. But it's good to, good to get some... Um, some information on these varieties through to through to everyone so thank thanks for that